I think it, it's touched a, a nerve with staff because they've all realised for many years that all those things underlie many young people's um, issues and behaviours and so on and so forth. But the way that we've been uh, sort of previously structured and how we've had to work on a very process-driven um, outcomes basis has detracted us from working specifically you know, with people with ACEs in the way that we would like to. Now, as, as I see, you know, that's, that's going to be completely changing over the next couple of years, and we're all very pleased because uh, it's easy to, to sort of um, deal with people's issues when, when they come to us, but we can't deal with the underlying issues because we're so process-driven. But having the awareness that we can now do that and finding the tools to do it and getting people skilled up, I think will completely revolutionise the, the way we work, and it will revolutionise our outcomes. We might not be able to deliver the same hard outcomes, but I think the soft outcomes which have a much longer lasting effect in an individual's life are, are the key things.